Hey everyone, how's it going? It's Shadbomb77 here, coming to you live with some Minecraft. Uh, yeah, so I did an earlier video on it, and um, it was just a little channel update. Well, that was just a little politics thing, but uh, this is something different. This is just going to be talking about the idea of Minecraft and its legitimacy as a game, uh, my thoughts on the whole game itself. So, I got Minecraft, just a little background information. I got Minecraft when it was in beta um, a while ago. And there was no health bar or no hunger bar, or anything like that. And I had seen a few videos on it originally, and uh, I wanted to see what it was about. You know, the whole concept of it's a game about nothing, you know, really appealed to me. But it's not a, a game about nothing. You can do so much more than just nothing with it and just kind of goof around. But it also has a really creative aspect to it, which is really nice. Um, and this is kind of one of kind of what I wanted to show off in this video was the creative things you can do with it. So this is my house um, on this server that a friend owns. And um, yeah, I mean, my whole thing is that a lot of people say, oh, it's a kid's game. It's, um, it's not really something for adults. But, you know, the thing is, even if it is a kid's game, it's still something which you can kind of you know, express your creativity with. I mean, look at this. Someone made a Zelda thing on it. Someone made a Yoshi on it. That's that's creativity. Um, all I could make was a flag and a pig. You know, a pen with animals and stuff in it. But still, it's it's expressing creativity. Um, you know, it. I, I would I would argue that it's making you a critical thinker. Um, you know, you have a problem. You want to get to the bottom of your mind. How are you gonna do it? Just take this minecart and get down there, and you can build it. And I know I use too many uh, electrical ones down there, but still, there's so many different things. I mean, and I think video games and television and stuff like that, they do have positive benefits. A lot of people like to say that they don't and they rot your mind and all that stuff, but you know, you, you definitely can pull a lot of things out of it that can benefit you in the real life, such as critical thinking, creativity, which um, I feel like kids these days. Uh, and I hate saying that, kids these days. I feel like that's missing from a lot of people. You know, is is a way to an outlook, an outlet for creativity. Um, and I feel like Minecraft is one way you can do it. And yeah, there's a lot of clones and knockoffs and all that stuff, but it's still a way which you can do that. I mean, I built a church on in here somewhere. Uh, it's gonna be hell to go find it, and I, I don't know how to make myself fly in this thing. But yeah, other than that, I just wanted to check up on all you guys, see how you guys and gals, see how you're all doing. Um, yeah, it's been fun just trying to find jobs out here in DC, just trying to have a good time. Um, been hard to make videos lately just because uh, I don't want to commit to a series and not be able to bring quality content at a uh, regular pace. So it's just been nice to um, get some time to do that lately. Uh, you know, over the weekend. So I'm just going to make this quick video, kind of just show what things are going on. I might do something with Minecraft, but I want to appeal to, you know, a large array of people. I'm not saying, you know, that uh, appealing to, you know, younger people who would enjoy this, I would imagine, is a bad thing, but I want it to be all inclusive and um, as inclusive as possible, you know, uh, for the entertainment value of it. Um, so yeah, I have Fallout 3 and New Vegas and all that, but those are really long-term games. I have Portal 2. Uh, these are all games I have not played yet, and they would be... Um, well, I've played Fallout 3 and New Vegas, but for consoles. Uh, in regards to Portal 2, I've never played it, so it would be a blind Let's Play. And that could be really frustrating, but I feel like the co-op mode would be a lot more fun uh, than just going in blind. So we'll see what happens with that. I'm um, still trying to get everything in the works of um, what I want to do next. YouTube is just a hobby. It's for fun. Um, it's just a way to a creative outlet. You know, we were talking about creative outlets. Um, I feel like YouTube is my creative outlet uh, to a certain degree. I'm starting to get a little bit better with some of the editing programs, um, which is really nice. So yeah, I'm just going to end it on that note, guys. This is a quick video. I just wanted to you know, talk about being creative and having uh, creative outlets and, you know, let people explore their creativity through Minecraft, you know, whether it be building a house, building a cool Legend of Zelda or Yoshi thing, or just 
making a pen filled with animals who you're probably gonna slaughter in a little bit. Okay, bye.